Hello everybody, EDDF Toxic here. Welcome back to Sunland. Today I'm going to be working on my room here. Um, so I'll start by putting my bed in a proper place. And uh, looks like it's nighttime out there, so I guess I'll sleep. Um, now, before I do, just watch the way I sleep here. That is the strangest way of sleep, and I'm actually sitting up on my lack of a backboard. Which is actually strange. But I think what they meant for me to do, if you actually watch somebody uh, externally, is uh, you're actually lying on your back, which... That's actually something I have a lot of trouble sleeping like that. Um, but uh, when I uh, hurt my elbow, uh, came back from the hospital and... Uh, I had to sleep on my back just because of the way my arm was uh, sitting, and that was not the easiest thing to do, let me tell you. I usually sleep on my side, um, usually facing the wall, which is to the left, just like in this room here. Um, I keep running down here, I because I want to... Uh, Just do one of those for now. I want to make a few chests. Except I'm going to put a diamond in the middle of one of these. And the rest of these will just keep as chests. I have way too much stuff in my inventory right now. Um, I'm going to kind of model this, this room well. Some of the things I'll be putting in here are things in my actual room. So, uh, um, like I said, uh, I have my bed in my room with a wall on the left, and that's usually the way I sleep, facing the wall. Um, and on the other side of the room, I have my iPod dock. And a whole bunch of CDs, let me tell you. There's a lot of them back there. Um, I don't have any music discs yet in this world, but uh, that's where I will keep them when I do. And actually, I'll just leave this as one shelf. Or one, uh... There's an axe right there. One chest. Uh... One thing already that's kind of, uh... Wrong, I guess. Um... Is, uh... Where'd I put my, on my ladder? Um, this room is upstairs. And, uh, my room in my house is actually in the basement. Um, so that's... I do not have enough of that. Um... Let me just dump some of this stuff here for now. I'll organize it later. Now, one of the problems with having my room upstairs is uh, mobs like to spawn on the top of this hill here, and uh, um, then they then I'm not able to sleep, which is a uh, slight bit of a problem. But I've actually lit up the lit up the top of the hill now, so it's working a little. It's most of the time I'm able to sleep. Occasionally there will still be someone up, somebody up there. And it will say you not, may not rest nearby because monsters are nearby. <laughs> you may not rest now, I mean, because monsters are nearby. Just going to make a bunch of books here. Um, as I've said before, I, I uh, used to read a lot when I was a kid, but uh, not as much lately. <sighs> Having trouble with this most lately. Although I have been trying to read a lot more. Um, but most of the time that when I read lately, it is... Uh, I read books on my phone now. I just find it easier to hold. Uh, some of my older books that I have, though, I do have... Still have physical copies of, or even some of the newer books. Um, and I'm actually going to put my bookshelf in this little corner here. And some of the books I have... Uh, 
are more popular than others. A series of unfortunate events. Uh, Jigsaw Jones, I used to read that a lot. Um, I also have a Magic Treehouse, which I remember reading, but don't really remember much about. And uh, Bailey School Kids, again, same thing. Um, Pokemon books, yeah. Everybody knows about those. Uh, the Littles, I'm not sure how, how popular those are. Uh, Captain Underpants is a pretty popular one. Secrets of Druin was definitely one of my favorite uh, series to read as a kid. And a couple, some other random books. Now in my room I actually have two bookshelves. Uh, one of them is on the floor and the other one is actually, since I'm in the basement, there's a giant ledge around the edge of my room, so I have a bunch of books up there. And they're mostly random books that I've never really read. Uh, but I do have some more of my newer books, uh, like uh, the John Green books or uh, Harry Potter books, um, that are all sitting in that area there. Um, I'm going to go grab some um, that stuff from the chest again, because I just realized I need it. Now, of course, those books aren't all that I used to read. There are other things. Um, some books I've tried to track down to read again, but they're just not that easy to find nowadays. Some of them I can't even remember the name of. Just some of these random books that I've read a long time ago, and I forgot where my crafting table was there for a second. Um, it was actually just in the... Uh, just grab these diamonds just before I started recording. There's my first diamond pick. And I'm going to take this all the way down these stairs. All the way down these stairs. <laughs> This is where I've been uh, mining from. Um, and over here is a little bit of lava, which has actually been uh, preventing me from continuing this, but this is kind of low anyway. It's got all the void fog, so it's kind of a pain to mine down here. But um, I'm going to cover this with some water. Yeah, of course. Take out the torch while I'm at it, because I'm that smart. And, uh... I forgot how hard it is to, uh... Mine when water is pushing you around. Water is pushing you around. I should uh, light this up again. That's my some obsidian. And since I'm a genius, I turned all of my put all my books on bookshelves and uh, forgot that I still need one here. But that being said, I now have another book and an enchanting table. Now, uh, in in my actual room, um, there's one corner of my room. It's nighttime already. <laughs> There's one corner of my room. I like to call it uh, the nostalgia corner because I tend to... Uh, this is kind of where I have all the little things that... When I was a kid, I had this... Um, I had uh, quite the interesting imagination, and I would uh, draw all sorts of maps and, and pictures and just really crazy things. And it's kind of magic of childhood memories if I go back in there to look at it again. Uh, so, enchanting table. That's uh, somewhat magic, right? So I guess I'll put that in the Nostalgia Corner then, because Nostalgia Corner is actually where, in the same corner of my room as the books. And since I have 50 levels now, let's see what I get as my first enchant here. 
I'm breaking three efficiency four. I'm glad I got a frickin' obsidian pick. <laughs> now, one of the other things that's, uh, that I have in, in the little closet where I store all my, um, all the stuff I made as a kid is, I do, I did write a few books. They're crazy, they make no sense, but they're there, and, uh, um, in Minecraft, sometimes you have 30 levels to use on an enchantment, and, uh, don't have anything really to enchant, so you just enchant a book. So put the magic into the book, put the magical book into the chest. That's what this chest will be for. Alright, um... You know what, I am going to switch these around here because the iPod dock is actually to the left of a uh, of the CD shelf. Technical detail, little details, you know. Um, one other thing that I want to do in this room here—it's still looking quite wide open, actually, but a bit more filled than it was before. Um, but uh, back to the topic. You may notice I made this window a bit bigger, um, and I made the ceiling three high now, which is uh, quite nice, except for this one spot here, and Nostalgia Corner, because, you know, I, it, Nostalgia Corner is about childhood, and you can crawl around in small places when you're a kid. That's my excuse. <laughs> the real reason I did that is actually because uh, um, it was just too hard to terraform on the, the top side up here. Um, but this window here, I've got a nice little view out there. It's even better if I jump up. So what I'm going to do here is... I'm just hoping this doesn't look too funny. Now I can walk up here. That is a nice view. Without having to jump just to get that view. And I'm going to do the same thing on this side here. Looking up to the savannah. This side isn't as good of a view as this side is. And the mountain is almost at a render distance. I don't know, it looks kinda cool. In a way I wish I could see it more, but in another way it just looks it looks cool faded like that. Um but uh yeah, so this is my room. And um that is also the end of this episode here. So, uh, thank you guys for watching, and, uh, have a good life! <laughs>